everyone, Marilla Steel here from Fashion Steel NYC, and welcome back to my channel and another Miami Spend a Few Days with Your Girl vlog. You guys, I don't know if you noticed in the intro of this video, but I do have a few new furniture pieces. I am very excited. Of course, I'm gonna show you guys what I got in. I got a bench for my hallway. I finally got my couch. Shout out to Lulu and Georgia because they literally gifted these pieces to me and honestly, I can't believe it. <laughs> these pieces are incredible. So I'm gonna show you some new furniture I got in. I'm also gonna go through and do an Amazon haul because y'all, I have been, I've been going wild with Amazon and just buying little knickknacks that I need for my house. And I think you all will love these products. Like they're products you never knew you needed. I bought a few things for my bathroom, some stools. I'm gonna show you guys everything home decor um, that's new. And then let's see, I went shopping yesterday, in the Miami Design District. So eventually I'm gonna rewind and uh, take you guys shopping with me. I'm gonna do a few unboxings. Brands have sent me tons of stuff. So I wanna go through and show you what's new and what's popping for spring, summer 2022. I'm going to an event. I'm shooting some campaigns and looks tomorrow. So it's gonna be a jam packed vlog, just how you all like it, nice and long. So make sure to grab your coffee, your tea, your wine, your snacks, and buckle up, cause it's gonna be a good one. So make sure to go ahead and give your girl a thumbs up and subscribe. It's gonna be a good day. All right guys, so let's start with some updates I've done to this hallway. If you watch my new house home decor tour, you already know this hallway is my favorite <laughs> spot in my new home. I just love how this window and how it frames all of these beautiful birds of paradise outside my window. I did get a new bench in. I wanted to definitely take advantage of this space because I'm always just kind of in this hallway. So let me show you what I got. So of course we already have my West Elm mirror. I do a lot of outfit of the day videos and speaking to you all in this mirror. It's from West Elm, it's a funny mirror so I don't care for it too much, but I will link it down below if anyone's interested. And then of course I have a few tulips here and this H&M vase. And these tulips I get weekly from Trader Joe's and they usually last about a week. Um, as long as you cut the stems like every three days. I just think they're so beautiful. So I wanted something here. And I saw this incredible bench on Lulu and Georgia. And um, I noticed that they have worked with a few influencers. So I literally reached out and they say, yeah, they gave me a, a huge credit and just let me pick out a few things. So I measured this bench and I thought it would be the perfect length for this hallway because it's not too wide. So it's not taking up a lot of space. It's very rustic. It gives me a place to kind of sit in the morning and do my journaling while I look in the mirror and do my affirmations. And so I just dressed it up a little bit. These things are probably not gonna stay here. One of the new things I got in from Amazon is this book. It's the Black is Beautiful book from Amazon. I'll link it down below. It's just a beautiful book. It has some amazing photos in it. This one is of Max Roach playing the drums in Harlem. Y'all know I'm a Harlem girl, but it's just some beautiful pictures and also some pretty good reads. The book is by Kwame um, Brathwaite, by the way. I got that in, that's new. The Louis Vuitton book is also from Marshalls, I believe. You can order online at Marshalls and have things delivered. I'll link that down below. And again, I just moved my Anissa Carmichi Love Handles Voss up here. I don't know if it's gonna stay here, but I just wanted to dress it a little just to see how it would look. I'm in love with it. I will link it down below. I'm not sure if I have a coupon code to Lulu in Georgia, but they have some incredible furniture. I will definitely link this bench down below. And if I have a coupon code, I will put that in the description box as well as a pinned comment. It's very rustic, it's giving rustic, <laughs> which is kind of what I wanna go for um, in this space, very light, very just, you know, earthy. That's my brand new bench. 
I absolutely love it. And I believe it's made from reclaimed wood, which is great. So I love it. Now I have a nice place to sit and just admire my favorite place in my home. I can journal, I can do my affirmations and just chill. I love it. Definitely coming along. I think that I'm pretty much done with this haul. Um, I might get like a little stand here to just prop my flowers on so they're not on the floor. But other than that, I think I'm pretty much done with this area. I might actually put some pictures on the walls too. Here, I think like one, two, three, four picture frames on the wall of my like family and friends. By the way, I wore this dress on my stories the other day and people went crazy for it. It's super old, it's from Nasty Gal. It's just literally a throw on dress that's probably meant to be worn outside but I choose to make it a house dress which is what I do with a lot of my dresses. If I can find something similar, I'll link it down below. My jewelry today, I'm wearing my Idol Diamonds, my Idol Diamond studs and my Idol Diamond necklace. Literally, since I work with them, I have not taken these pieces off. Like, I love them. And then my Hermes click clack. All right, so let's go down to the living room and I'm gonna show you guys my new couch because I love it. All right, guys, so we are here in my living room. My living room is actually not that big. It's an all-in-one room, basically a living room, a dining room, and a kitchen. Um, but it gets the job done. It's big enough for just me. Finally got my couch in. I was really in the market for something quite small. I believe this couch is 85 inches long. And then as far as the width, it's about, I wanna say like 33. So it's a fairly like skinny long couch, but I love it. And of course it's from Lulu in Georgia. So let's get into the specs of it. All right guys, so here's my couch. It is a white boucle. It's not actually like stark white. It's more like a creamy white boucle. It's literally the same color as the old couch I had in my other Miami apartment. Um, I got rid of that couch. Um, I wanted something with curves because this, this house has a lot of sharp lines. Um, and I wanted some curves to like soften the space a bit. So I love how the corners of this couch are curved, how the bottom of it is curved. It's fairly deep, even though it's a skinny couch and it is long enough for me to lay completely all the way down on, which I like. These pillows are pillows that I've had from my old apartment. They're like linen covered pillows. I'm pretty sure I got these from either Target or Parachute Home. I'm gonna check my old Miami uh, house tour <laughs> and I'm gonna link the pillows down below. So I just have two in this corner and in this corner I have this beautiful throw. It's one of those super fuzzy ones that are just like super warm. This is actually a gift from my girl Ashley. She has a YouTube channel, it's called From Head to Curve. Um, she is super, super sweet. She wanted to send me a gift and she sent this to me. So girl, I'm using it. Thank you, boo. Um, and definitely go check out her channel. I love her videos from head to curve. Um, she's, she's incredible. I have some amazing like friends, like internet friends, because we've actually never met, but we've spoken so many times. Like uh, we're basically like friends. <laughs> That's the wonderful thing about social media. Um, a lot of the friends I've made, we just DM <laughs> for years. Um, and then, you know, we build a relationship and that's that's really the great thing about social media. Anywho, love this couch. Got it from Lulu and Georgia. I will link it down below. I believe it comes in another color as well. And I know someone is gonna be like, oh, white couch, like how could you? I live alone <laughs> and I wanted a white couch. Like I said, this room is quite small and so I didn't want anything that would be distracting or take up too much space and I felt like a darker couch would just make the space look even smaller. So I'm sticking to very like light woods, light birches, other than like black accents here in this room. Uh, they also have a similar couch to this at Card Cardio, 
website. I'll link this exact one and I'll link similars because I know this one is quite pricey, but I almost got another one that was a little bit more affordable. So that is my couch. I'm in love with her. This room is coming together. Um, all I have to do now is get the TV mounted and then I want to put some custom shelving up. I want some under the stairs storage because there's not much storage in this place. And then I think I'm pretty much done with this room other than getting like some art. That's what's new in. Oh, let me show you the rug because the rug is new in from Amazon. I kind of want it to differentiate the spaces. So I find that rugs are a great way to do that, um, especially in a small space. So let me show you this rug from Amazon. So here's the rug. At first I wasn't sold on it, but I actually like how it differentiates the spaces. This is a jute rug from Amazon, super durable, love it. I had the same rug in my old uh, Miami apartment. I just ordered a new one. I believe it's under 200 bucks. And I think this is the five by eight feet. And I love it. I feel like it really says, hey, this is the living area. Whereas this faux cowhide rug from Wayfair says, hey, this is the dining area. I'll link both of these rugs down below. They come in a few different sizes, super affordable, very durable, which is what I like. All right, guys, so before I head on up to get myself more presentable for you, put on a face, um, I'm gonna show you a few more things that I got from Amazon that really came through for me. All right, guys, so first up, I got these Joseph and Joseph spice holders which are incredible you literally just pop them here into your cabinets and then these pull out and drop down and you can line up all of your spices like if you don't have a lot of cabinet space or you just want to organize your spices this is meant to stand up like this but these things are too big i need to go get standard size <laughs> spice bottles and like transfer everything but like once I have them all, they'll be all lined up and they'll sit in here perfectly. And then I can literally just pop them up. Like how cool is this? You don't need to do any like building. It literally pops right off. There is a little tape thing there that you can tape. But other than that, this will just stick right on any standard size. Like cabinet like how cool is that and I got two as soon as I get like all of my little spice bottles and I found out that Lulu in Georgia has really cute little um, customizable spice bottles that will fit in here I'm gonna order the set and then I'm gonna transfer all of my spices into them and label them and then pop them in here for like discreet you know cabinet space saving I also got some wine glasses from Amazon because your girl needs wine these are beautiful and they are very durable and what I love is that they don't have a sticker on them like it's so hard to find wine glasses that don't have a sticker and then you have to peel it off and it's just a mess these are wonderful quality I've used them and I'll link them down below if you're looking for some beautiful uh, wine glasses that are very affordable now these black wine glasses I got these from H&M uh, home and I love the color I think they're so cool but they do come with a sticker and it's just hard to get the sticker off but i'll get it done and then i just needed some basic cups these are also from amazon and they are wonderful like i love the shape they are plastic so i went with four larger ones and four smaller ones so i'll link those down below i also got some more black like taller like flute almost um champagne glasses here in the corner from H&M Home. I love those as well, they have a sticker. I have to get the sticker off. So also from H&M Home, I got this little spatula, which I think is so cool. I love the wood elements. There are wood elements throughout like my space. Again, I wanna keep things nice and natural. So this, if I'm cooking and I need to put something down, this is what I do. This is rubber, I believe, very easy to clean. It also comes with a spoon. So it's the cutest little set. Oh, actually, no, I got this from Zara Home. Sorry, guys. <laughs> so I'll be sure to link this down below if anyone's interested. They come with a whole bunch of different, like, big utensils, but I only wanted the spoon. Also from Amazon, I got these little pot holders for when the pot is hot, but I want to take it off the glass stove. It gives you 
a few centimeters so it's not on the actual counter and then usually I just take my our place pan after I finish like cooking and I just pop it on one of these and it works wonderfully it came in this pack of three I went with like pretty much grays because there's a gray theme throughout my space as well so it came with all three of these and I believe it was like I don't know maybe like seven dollars so and they're very well made so if you're interested in these I'll link them as well all right guys we're currently in one of my guest bathrooms this is the least decorated one but i wanted to show you what i got from amazon i realized i don't have any toilet paper rolls like or uh towel racks they were supposed to be put in um but they never were it's a long story so my temporary solution was to buy this shiny chrome toilet holder uh from amazon and I like it because it does match like the chrome here and the chrome I have on my sink. It's like a shiny chrome. But they do have different colors like black, polished brass. This worked out perfect. And you can also like move it and it swivels. So it's a great option if you have a tiny space and you just don't want to put a hole in the wall. Um, over here I have this tiny... <laughs> very super thin garbage can that also comes with a toilet brush i had this same trash bin in my old miami apartment i got this from amazon it comes in a ton of different sizes so if you have a tiny tiny space like between your toilet and sink these work perfectly it's also push touch and then this little area here this pops out and it's literally like a little toilet brush down there so this is great, it's super skinny. I didn't mean to buy the tiniest one. I'm probably gonna end up putting this under the sink and buying a bigger one <laughs> for this bathroom. But I ended up buying three of these. The other two are larger in size and I'll show those to you. So I'll link those down below if anyone's interested. All right guys, so that's pretty much it for this floor. If you wanna know uh, the links and things to other things you've kind of seen throughout, like my pompous grass, my other vases, my other books, please check out my um, new home decor tour. I'll link it down below. I've literally linked everything I have in my house so far in that video. I'll also link my New York City home decor tour, which has everything linked below the video as well. If you're looking for home decor, I got you. All right guys, so this is another one of my bathrooms. And as you can see in my shower, there is no like storage space. So I ended up buying this cool little wooden stool from Zara Home. I actually bought two of them. One is for the other bathroom that I just put all of my products on. And it comes in quite handy. I love the look of it because this bathroom is like all marble and it just looks very modern. So in order to just give it like more of a home, homey type feel, um, this stool came in perfect to give it, you know, a little, a little wood. And as you can see, it has all of my products on it. My Tula skincare, my Clinique, my Native Body Gel, my Flamingo Shaving Cream. Um, sorry about the echo. I'll link all of these things down below, but so far this has come in fairly handy. I also got this gray bath mat from H&M Home. I love it. It's nice and comfortable. It has the non-skid on the bottom. I mean, with these marble floors, like I don't want to get out of the shower and like fall. <laughs> so this came in perfect. I love that it kind of matches the tile as well. So it kind of ties in that gray. The little trash can again is from Amazon. You see how it fits perfectly between this little so if you have a tiny space this is great and then it also comes with that little cleaner where you can scrub your toilet and it's again push touch and I believe they come in other colors yeah but they're very easy to clean I know because I'm a brown girl sometimes I get makeup on this and I clean it it comes right off and then again we have another one of those toilet rolls from Amazon that I'll link down below i also wanted to show you guys my drawer organization because i'm kind of an organization geek look how perfect this is 
I love it. So I did buy some organizers from Amazon. I'm gonna show them to you. So this middle area already came like pre-made like this. So I ended up buying these little cubes from Amazon. And it comes in like a box of 20 different sizes. And I just use, as you can see, a ton of them to organize different things. For instance, this whole one here has all of the skincare products I use very regularly. So I have my Super Goop, I have my um, Tula SPF, I have my Tula Brightening Treatment, I have my Beauty Counter Moisturizer. <laughs> this I use very frequent, uh, my Caudalie, I have my Kiehl's moisturizer. By the way, I use a ton of different products in my skincare. I like to switch it up so my skin stays on its toes. Huge fan of Beauty Counter, huge fan of Tula, Caudalie, all the good ones. As you can see, I have my Beauty Counter Reflect Effect AHA mask. I use this once a week to help exfoliate dead skin. It's incredible. And then of course I have my uh, The Ordinary Glycolic Acid. All of these are kind of organized. I have my cotton pads, my Q-tips. And then over here, I put another little organizer in for like my toothbrushes, my toothpaste, my mouthwash, and it's just very organized. So if you're interested in these little organizers for the drawers from Amazon, I'll link them down below. So let's get into the second drawer. Like, look how stunning this is. Like, I'm obsessed. I have all of my like feminine hygiene things. They're all in this little tray. I have a tray here. It's a square tray, which has all of my cleansers, all of my different facial cleansers and my um, body SPFs. By the way, a lot of people are asking what am I using on my body for SPF? And it's mostly this Australian gold plant-based 70 aloe and coconut. Really, really incredible. I'll link this down below. And then you can see over here, I have a tray specifically for my deodorants. I have my vitamins. And this little tray here, I have all of my nail things. And this tray here, this was actually full of razors. I have some soap there, my flamingo, waxing for my lips and such. Look how organized that is. You guys, I will link these Amazon trays below because they are lifesavers. All right, love, so here in my office slash closet space, there's not too many updates other than I switched to rose lilies. I was using regular lilies, but of course they have that little stem inside that can stain things and I was just cutting them out, but even that got to be too much. Like I don't wanna stain the floors or anything like that. So I switched over to rose lilies, which have the same look but they look like roses, like they're so beautiful. And honestly, until I saw them in the store, I didn't even know rose lilies existed. So now I've switched over to white rose lilies because I still love the look. They are stunning. They're kind of dying now, but they're stunning. Trust me. Um, I also got a new purse stand. It's like a chrome gold. I'm kind of wishing I got silver now, but that's okay. And I use this to just hang my handbags can see here you can adjust the length it's like a t-bar and I just put all my bags on there this is also from Amazon so if you guys need like a purse stand or you just want to hold items <laughs> I'll link this down below I got a few of these too what I'm thinking of doing is getting custom shelving and then putting all my bags with these hooks I just have my new Bottega bag my sequin Fendi my new lavender Prada bag and then my new Brandon Blackwood bag. I also got a new Brandon Blackwood bag, which is this one. <laughs> I was gonna do an unboxing later, but since it's already right here, I've been wanting this bag ever since his first drop. I believe it was in 20, 2021 of this bag. I missed out. Then he restocked, I missed out on that. I literally missed out on like four restocks of this bag until he surprised redropped it on a 420 and a few of you messaged me and I was able to secure the black Brandon Blackwood bamboo bag. 
I love it. So I also have it in brown. I love the brown one as well, but the black was really the one I wanted the most, but now I have two and super affordable as well. Brandon Blackwood, black owned designer. I'm just really into his bag. So this is a new bag that I have in a little birthday gift to myself. And also if you follow my Instagram, you would have seen this little baby <laughs> Louis Vuitton bag as well. I think I unboxed it in the last video, but I did a reel before I dropped any videos on my Instagram showing this vanity case. Head on over to my Instagram to see what fits inside. You gotta read my caption for that. <laughs> so I believe that's it for new in like Amazon things, but everything that I've shown you guys, I would definitely link down below and you can check it out. A few people asked where I got my uh, clothing racks, Amazon as well. These are just temporary clothing racks until I actually get my closet built. So if you're in need of like an industrial clothing rack, I will link this down below. It fits a ton of stuff. <laughs> it's great for just storing things until my closet is finished. All right guys, so that's it for like home decor updates. I do have a ton more things coming in. So I'll keep you guys posted because I still need like a nightstand, I need a desk, I need a chair, I need patio furniture. So I'm taking my time, I'm not gonna rush. As I get new things, I will always put a home decor in the title so you'll know it's an update. By the way, Target, the best. It's linked down below. I'm gonna get myself together, put on a face, put on some actual clothes. And then when I come back, I'm gonna show you guys, I'm gonna do a quick little haul of things that brands have sent me. I'm very lucky that brands send me so much like clothing and shoes and things. I honestly don't have to spend a lot of money on clothes, but because I want this channel to reflect my style, I'm always gonna still buy clothes. <laughs> um, and it's really great that I still get to choose the things that brands send me. Um, a lot of times brands just wanna send me anything. They're like, oh, I wanna send you a shirt. Oh, I wanna send you something from our brand. I'm very selective about what I'm sent because I just, I don't wanna have an excess of stuff that I'm never gonna wear or never gonna use. So while I get myself together, I am going to rewind it back to yesterday when I headed to the Miami Design District followed by Curio at Faina Bazaar to do some shopping. I was looking for like a birthday dress and I ended up getting other things. So I will wind it back, show you all that footage and then we'll come back to present day and I'll do an unboxing. So come with me shopping at the Miami Design District. Hey y'all, so I just got myself together, did a very like basic neutral makeup look. The lip is Modest Matte by Absolute New York. I'm pretty sure you can find it at like Walmart or Target. And of course my diamond earrings and diamond necklace are from Idol. I recently did a sponsored like YouTube video with them showing a few of their pieces. All of their diamonds are lab grown. All of their 14 karat gold is cruelty free. I love them. The price points are so good. And I believe they're currently having like a 20% off like everything. So definitely check them out. Very dainty, very demure. The dress is new in from H&M. I believe it was like $30. It's a shirt dress. Let me show it to you. So here is my look for today. Excuse the mess. I'm gonna clean everything up, I promise. But I'm wearing this shirt dress. It's just literally a button up super long shirt dress from H&M. I got the medium, absolutely love it. It's great for like a cover up. I rolled up the sleeves, but they the sleeves are super long. Here's what the sleeves look like when they're not rolled up. This dress is a tiny bit see-through, um, just a tiny bit, not much. Um, and I paired it with my Loewe OB denim belt. This is also in a medium. Um, if I can find it anywhere, I'll link it down below. And the sandals are my new Anne Hermes um, Orion sandals that you would have seen me unbox in a previous vlog along with um, a few things from 
Louis Vuitton. So yeah, that's the look. I'm gonna pick a fragrance. I'm probably gonna wear my Bottega bag. But the goal for today is just to find something for my birthday. I ordered a dress from Fina Well, one of my favorite black designers for my birthday. Um, it was a pre-order and I'm just kind of nervous that it's not gonna get here in time which I'm really sad about because I had plans for shooting that dress. Hopefully it comes in time and I'm able to actually wear it during my birthday weekend. But I wanted to shoot some photos in it for like a birthday reel I'm putting together. And then I also wanted to wear it to one of my birthday dinners. Hopefully it comes, but just in case it doesn't, I don't wanna wait to the last minute and then not have anything like special to wear although i have a ton of special things i'm on the lookout for just like a really nice dress i'm attending an event in new york soon and it's gonna be amazing <laughs> so i need kind of like a dressy dress for like a cocktail for a michelin like star restaurant with a huge brand um and i have a dress in mind from veronica beard but I need to go to the store and try it on. Some of the reviews said that they run small, so I wanna try it on. So maybe we'll do that today as well. Gonna head to the Miami Design District, hopefully find Veronica Beard. Maybe I'm gonna go to Curio at Faina. You guys love the last time I went there. I tried on a ton of dresses. Um, I actually made a little reel of all of the dresses that I tried on at Curio at Faina Bazaar. By the way, if you're not following me on Instagram, you're playing yourself. If you're not following me on TikTok, you're playing yourself. I am Monroe Steele, M-O-N-R-O-E-S-T-E-E-L-E -E -E on both platforms. That's what we're on the lookout for today. I also want to head to Hermes because I want to see if they have this pink scarf that I want to wear as a sarong with one of my bathing suits. So let's choose a fragrance get my bag together, and we're gonna head to the Miami Design District. All right, today's fragrance, we're gonna go with Old Faithful Mich Mixture, La Labo Te Noir 29, which is very mysterious, smells incredible, mixed with my favorite, which is the Baccarat Rouge 540. I will link both of these down below if any of you are interested. The mixture of these two is the one and not the two. I got my Jody bag, oversized white leather. And that's the look for today. Of course, I will link everything down below. Hopefully this H&M um, dress is still available.
gotten myself together and I hope you enjoyed spending that shopping day with me. I went to the Miami Design District. I got a little something from Hermes. I went to a few stores. I had a delicious lunch at, I think it's called Mia, like the food court they have there at the Miami Design District. I grabbed my Alto. Don't forget, I do have a code Monroe20, all capital letters, for $20 off your first two rides at Alto. They have them in LA, they have them in, in Texas, in DC, and of course, Miami. And I headed over to Curio at Faena Bazaar. Tried on a few things there. I will link everything I tried on, but nothing was really speaking to me as far as like, you know, dresses. Um, and then I just headed across the street to Faena Hotel. I got myself a strawberry daiquiri. I looked at the dinosaur a bit, and I just relaxed, and then I came on home. But I do want to show you guys what I got from Hermes, and then I want to show you guys a few pieces I got in from Karen um, Millen. I absolutely love Karen Millen. I have a few pieces from them. I actually have this stunning, like, green floral midi dress that I shot not too long ago. I also did a reel, and you all went crazy for it. Happy to be partnering with them on this portion of the video. So without further ado, let me show you what I got from Hermes and then I'll show you what I got from Karen Millen. I'm also going to be shooting both of the pieces that they sent me tomorrow so you'll see them again. And I also plan on wearing one of the dresses to an event I have coming up. By the way, the lip is Pat McGrath um, and it is Executive Realness. It's like a creamy, like really punchy, like pink beautiful I'll link it down below in case any of you are interested and again I'm wearing the dress from Amazon <laughs> I have been living in this dress um, size down it's a an amazing knit um, dress from one of the Amazon drops but I think they made it a staple I'll link it down below because it's good I have it in this color and I have it in this bright coral like orange but I washed it and I'm back in it because it's one of my best like lounging dresses all right without further ado Let's get into the unboxing. Okay, so let's start from Hermes. What I picked up, definitely nothing, not a bag. <laughs> Just another pair of sandals. I realized, like you guys know, I'm a heel girl and I will wear heels into the sun, but like it's a lot of walking that I do in Miami and I need more flats. And not just any flats, real flats. Like I have flats that still have a heel. Um, but now I'm definitely getting more into flat sandals and also sneakers. But I want, you know, elevated ones that are nice and I'm going to last because I'm going to wear them into the ground. So when I went in and I saw this color, your girl could not resist. Here they are. I mean, it's giving. It's giving spring. It's giving fun. Um, I feel like for any of my neutral dresses, like this white one, this white midi dress from Amazon, that this, these would be perfect. They will also look great with like brown and I have a lot of like brown dresses just throw on and go. They will also look really good with denim. You guys know I love green. Green is my favorite color. And these are like so punchy and fun. Are they stunning? So apparently this color just came out and I just happened to stop in because I really want the orange ones. Y'all know orange is another one of my favorite colors. I want the orange ones that are like almost the color of the Hermes box. They didn't have those, but they said that they might be getting them in soon. But then I saw these and they actually had them in my size. And I wear almost like the largest size in these sandals. I wear a 41 and a half. I'm normally a 41 in any like European made shoe, but these run a little bit small to me. So if you got bigger feet, you're gonna have to size up girl. And the fact that they actually had them in my size, I had to get them. Love these. I actually styled one of my Karen Millen dresses with these. So actually let's get into the Karen Millen dresses. The first one, you guys, it's like the hottest color of the season. This beautiful, like limey, punchy green dress. And it's a cow neck dress. It has the skinniest little straps that are super dainty and beautiful. It has a hidden zipper up the back. And then it also has like a little ruching around like the mid area to like, you know, cover anything that you don't want shown. And then the bottom of it is just really flirty. It's almost like a little asymmetrical. So stunning, amazing quality, like slightly heavy. Like this is a great quality dress. Um, I believe this comes in a few colors. I went with my normal size, which is a US size six. Fits perfectly. 
absolutely perfectly um and any of like the caramel dresses that i have just go with your normal size because they fit really well and then i styled this dress with the only other pair of orion sandals that i have that i recently got in and it's these like denim brown with the white stitching i feel like the denim with this color green just really worked so that is the first piece i will link this down below and you all can check it out i um, in addition to just linking this dress i'm gonna link a few of my favorites from caramelin because she has some um the brand has some amazing dresses for spring and for summer and also like for events so if you're planning a birthday if you're going to a wedding if you are going to like a fancy event they have a dress for everyone uh so good the next dress is a little more like demure and i love dresses like this i love the shape of this i love the pattern of this the colors let me get it on the hanger nicely so you all can see it. Ugh, it was, it was the colors for me. I absolutely love the print. It's so fun. The base of the dress is white, so of course you can really pair this with anything. I'm loving this high neck. And it, it has a, two gold buttons around the neck and then it has a little portion that's out in the back but not too much, not too revealing. And it's just a beautiful, midi dress it has a slit a tiny slit on both sides that's not very high at all it does have um, a piece underneath so you're nice and covered so this dress is lined but it's just a beautiful floaty perfect spring dress it has a hidden zipper here on the side and again i went with my normal size a us size six fits perfectly i'm normally a us size six a medium um, a 28 in jeans and it fits beautifully like look at all of these colors that blue that orange that green and because it has that stunning green in it i did pair it with my brand new hermes sandals and it just it works i'm definitely gonna wear this outfit to a specific event i have coming up so be on the lookout we're also gonna shoot this tomorrow so such a beautiful dress i will link this dress down below i mean this is perfect for like a wedding or like a brunch or just it's it's very very chic very elegant very timeless but still youthful and fun because of the colors so i will be sure to link both of those dresses from karen millen down below as well as just a few other dresses from the website that i love that i think you will all love they have amazing price points there's something for everyone. So shout out to Karen Miller for sponsoring this portion of the video. Shout out to our sponsors. We love our sponsors. So let's get into a few more things that I have gotten in from brands. So next up, I got a pair of shoes from Dear Francis. And I'm so happy they reached out because I actually wanted a similar shoe from Hermes and they didn't have them um, in my size. And so, so lucky to have these love the box i'm gonna open these with you guys not me not being able to get in a box okay here we go comes with a little card saying that my shoes were made in italy by skilled artisans love that and how to care for your shoes the shoes come in a beautiful dust bag which is nice and here they are Aren't they giving Hermes? They're beautiful. I love the ridges on the bottom so they're not slippery. They have that custom leather with that stitching on top. And the padding on this is super cushy so they are very comfortable. I absolutely love these sandals. So if you're looking for like that Hermes like look, but more cushion, more comfortable, and also more affordable definitely check out dear francis you can see on the shoes it says dear and Fr dear on one and francis on the other such incredible quality for these i went with a 41 which is my normal U U euro size um, i'm a us size 10 they fit perfectly very comfortable in fact i'm probably going to wear these today because i have a nail appointment these are the bari slides in white they do come in a few other colors so i will link these down below you can check out the website but they are extremely comfortable like this 
plush padding here uh it feels like you are walking on a cloud so special thanks to dear francis for these amazing bari slides in white i think i want to get the other color i think they have like a beautiful neutral color as well which these would just be great every day very comfy slides that you can do a lot of walking in and here's how they look compared to the orans they are a lot wider a lot more comfy a lot more cushiony these don't need to be broken in the way that Oran sandals need to, but yeah, absolutely loving them. I'm gonna wear these today. I do have a few other things in as far as like clothing, but you all will see everything tomorrow when I shoot with my girl Maria. I need to shoot a campaign for Christian Dior uh, beauty and uh, skincare. I need to shoot a few things for Derek Lamb. Of course, I'm going to shoot my Karen Millen things. And then I got a little something from my girl, Karen Britchick, her Amazon drop that I will be uh, shooting as well. So you'll see all those things tomorrow. Right now, it's about 11 and I'm starving because all I've had today was a cup of coffee. I really need to stop doing that. Normally, I eat a banana or something for breakfast. But I just wanted to get up and get a head start on filming for today. It's almost, well, it's 11.08. So I'm going to make myself a sandwich and then I'm going to sit down on my laptop. I'm going to do the description box for today's video. Today is Wednesday. A new video always goes live on Wednesday as well as Sundays and sometimes a bonus on Fridays. Are you subscribed? Can you check real quick and see if you are subscribed? Because a lot of y'all be watching the videos and y'all not subscribed. Now, I understand if you just don't like me, but you just want to hate watch. No, I actually don't understand. Just go ahead and subscribe, girl. You like me. You like the videos. They're good. They're informative. You know, I'm giving value. I'm giving fun. I'm giving personality. I'm giving tips. I'm showing you what's new. Like, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the subscribe button. Your girl is trying to make it to 100,000. Like, I've kind of done the math, and I can almost do it if, like, literally just everyone who actually watches my videos subscribes. It costs you nothing, you know, and it will help me out so much. It's a huge goal of mine that I really want to hit this year. Actually, it's like the number one goal for this year. Please help me out. I would love for you to tell your family, tell your friends. Thank you. And a lot of you have been subscribing. Like, I've gotten more subscriptions in the last month than, like, as long as I've been on YouTube. So, shout out to the people who, who know. When you know, you know. I appreciate y'all. All right. Let's get some work done and then we're going to head to get these nails done and then we'll probably chill until tomorrow. my lunch and got my YouTube video description box ready the video is an hour and 20 minutes long so it took me that long to get it ready because I actually have to watch the video and then put in every little thing that I talk about show y'all know I'm very dedicated to my description box so it took a while um, it is now about 2 p.m. I think I started at like 11 and then I took a break Y'all know how I do. But I forgot to show you guys one more thing that I got from Lulu in Georgia that they sent over. And it is this French cutting board. Um, this pretty much embodies how I want my house to feel. It is so thick and beautiful. I think I'm gonna do like a charcuterie board with this. I love like the black handles. I mean, this thing is heavy. It is thick, but it's absolutely Stunning. So I can use this as a, as a cutting board, one side for meat, one side for veggies. I can also use it as like a serving plate when I have like my little outdoor 
dinners, which I plan to do. I think I'm gonna get a grill and I'm gonna get an outdoor table and chairs. I could just see putting a beautiful spread on this. So I'll link this down below again from Lulu in Georgia and shout out to them because they did send me this as well. They're pretty incredible. I may have a coupon code for 20% off i just have to check with them and make sure it's just not for me that i can extend it to you all my audience i also just got a package in from amazon i ordered the irish cream syrup that you can kind of use for like coffees and things they use this at starbucks and the last time i went to starbucks i requested the irish cream and they were like oh it's gone out of season so i went on amazon and i found it myself so I almost want to make myself a coffee just so I can try this. So I might do that. I'm gonna watch a little Tamara. I love Tamara. She is incredible. I love her videos. I love her fashion. She is just that girl. I'm trying to get on that level, like millions. <laughs> the millions level, that's where I'm trying to be. And I'm gonna get there. It's, you know, I'm working hard. I'm gonna get there. But I'm gonna watch a little bit of her and then I'm gonna head to my nail appointment. My nails look crazy. My toenails are all chipped. I will check back in with you guys when I'm at the nail salon. And I know they're gonna give me some alcohol, so I should probably eat a little bit more. You know they like to you know, get you nice and full on um, Prosecco's there, which is why I love them. They also do an amazing job. Guys, still watching tomorrow. I made another coffee. The Irish cream syrup. A plus, a little oat milk, a little hazelnut, I mean, a little Irish cream syrup. Not much, it's perfect. Almost tastes as good as Starbucks. I'll link the syrup down below because you can get it at Amazon. Well, one thing that I've done guys. from Hanan for Hannah Nil and Spa. It is on Collins and I believe 21st Street, um, right next to the Joe the Juice. 
right below Boulogne where I normally used to stay a lot. I love going there. They do an amazing mani-pedi. Of course, I got the Coconut Silver OPI on my nails and then the Zoya Purity, which is white on my toes. I usually do the same thing, y'all. And it lasts about a week, which is great. Um, they also have a pop-up shop there by um, the Social Girls Miami. And they have like really nice like beach dresses, occasion dresses. I picked out a really lovely dress. They actually gifted it to me, which is beautiful. I flipped through their book because they actually have a book and just the dresses are great. So if you happen to go there to get your nails done, definitely check out the pop-up that's there as well. Check out some of the dresses. I believe they're all mostly under like 300 bucks, which is great. But the dress that I picked out, I'm definitely shooting for my birthday. So it's just really, it's kind of serendipitous because I did go shopping the other day. I didn't find anything. And then they just offered me this dress like in exchange for, you know, social media or whatever. So very, very happy about that. Shout out to them. I always have an amazing time when I'm there. They always fill me up with Prosecco. So your girl is a little tips, tipsy right now. It's true. But my nails are looking good. Very happy. I need to book a few flights. I'm going to be in and out of Miami over the next month. So I'm gonna go ahead and end today. Tomorrow we are shooting tons of fashion looks, so be ready for that. And we're also going to an event with Greece. I previously went to an event with Australia, now I'm going to like a dinner with Greece. So that should be fun. I love Greek food, so I'm looking forward to it. I will check in with you guys. Minyana. By the way, these sunnies are from and other stories. They're like 30 bucks and they're everything. I'll link them. Um, they come in like four different colors as well. All right, guys. See you, Minyana. Good morning everyone, welcome to, I believe, day two of the vlog. I made myself a nice Irish cream coffee this morning with that new syrup that I got from Amazon that I will link down below. I just put on a really neutral face. This lip is Absolute Matte by, no, it's Modest Matte by Absolute New York. I'll link it down below. This little dress is an oldie from Nasty Gal. I don't think they still make it, but I'll link some similes down below. Um, we're gonna shoot today. I have a ton of things to shoot. I need to shoot a campaign for Dior. I need to shoot a campaign um, for Lulu and Georgia showing my new couch and the pieces I got in from them. I need to shoot something kind of top secret that you'll find out about in about a week and a half, maybe two weeks. And then I just have a few looks from Karen Millen that I showed you all that I'm shooting today and a little something from Derek Lamb as well. Maria's here. We're gonna shoot. Um, I'll show you guys a little behind the scenes and remember everything that you see me rock will be linked down below in the description box. Um, let me show you the dress that I got when I was at um, Henna um, Nail Spa yesterday. They do have that pop up there. Um, let me show you what I got. All right guys, so they have the Social Girls Miami like little pop up boutique there at the spa. So definitely check them out but they gifted me this beautiful dress and I'm probably going to wear for uh, my birthday. So nice, it smells good too. I don't know what they have sprayed on, but it's kind of like a V-neck with these little fringe and then the stomach here has this little button and then it's like a net skirt with like attachable underwear. It's really nice. I feel like this will look great like on the beach. So when I do like my birthday shoot, I'll probably like wear this dress. Hopefully my other dress from Fina Well comes in time. But this is a medium, it fits great. I'll link them down below. It smells so good. And you can check them out. All right, so let's get to shooting because your girl is hungry. And, and I'm ready to eat. All right guys, here's the first look. I'm gonna shoot this with the pieces that I got from Lulu and Georgia. 
This dress is by the brand Vera and they are a new brand that is currently up on, I believe, Revolve. Um, and the PR brand, they just sent me this dress. They also sent me another dress and I just think it's so beautiful. It's off the shoulder. It's a stretchy material. It has this little open area here and it's almost like a little tulip dress. It is stunning. I absolutely love it. I'll link it down below if any of you are interested. All right guys, so I have to shoot this Christian Dior gift set. It is absolutely beautiful. It's a great gift for Mother's Day. They have a ton of different gift sets with perfumes, candles, beauty products. I'll link a few of my favorites down below and they're actually really affordable. Like, look at this packaging. This is stunning. Of course, it comes with a little card, but I absolutely love how they wrap this. So I'm gonna open it for you guys. All right guys, so here's what I'm shooting for Dior, pretty much to promote their gift sets for Mother's Day. They have amazing gift sets, by the way. So here we go. Each gift set, you can choose like a free gift, which is great. Look at this packaging, so good. I ended up going with a mascara. I got the Dior Show mascara. It's a really great size, even though it's like a sample gift, which is great. And then of course, loving this. This will be great to put like rings and jewelry in during travel. And then I also got some mousse. This is their purifying foaming cleanser. Y'all know that I double cleanse, sometimes triple cleanse every night. And I like to use a different product that does something different for every cleanse. So I definitely wanted to try out the Dior La Mousse. I've heard really good things about it. So I'll link this down below as well. And how cute is this that this was actually propped on the top of this like little Christian Dior pillow. It's like a little pillow. I mean, I don't know what I'm going to do with this, but this is really cute. I can like put my sunglasses on top of this or I don't know what I'm going to do with this, but it's very, very cute. This little pillow. All right. So let's get to the actual gift set, which comes in this nice dust bag. Again, you can use this for travel. Of course, put a lot of cool things in there. I'm very, very excited about this because there's a candle in there and y'all know I love a candle. So get into the packaging get into it by the way i have linked this set down below and all of the products down below and also a few more of my favorite gift sets from christian dior that i would think would make amazing gifts not just for mother's day but if you have a friend that has a birthday coming up um, maybe an anniversary a special occasion you know they accomplish something great send them one of these gift sets they will thank you for it so it opens really cool look at that for me and there are seven fragrances here there are many fragrances which is really nice they have the amber nui the oud i'm about to try some of these this spice blend grease dior jasmine um rouge all really cool and like a really good amount comes in every single one like you can't tell me this isn't the perfect like that girl gift I mean, it also comes with oh watch this Oh, so cute. So it also comes with a hand wash, which is here. This is a body cream and then also a candle. I mean, it's so cute. It's the perfect gift set. So I'm about to take a few pictures with some of these products for my Instagram, but we'll definitely link a few more Dior sets down below, including this one that I think you all would love. <music>
shooting. Maria and I shot six pieces of content today. The first thing we shot, I was wearing this beautiful Yara yellow kind of cut out off the shoulder dress. And we just got some content with my brand new bench um, that I have in my hallway from Lulu and Georgia. Absolutely love their furniture. Shout out to them for sending that over as a gift. And then we also finished it up by getting some film and some photos with my brand new couch which is also from Lulu and Georgia. I will link both of those down below. The photos came out incredible. After that, we shot something top secret that you will see soon, probably closer to my birthday. I'm dropping something major, a very major announcement. So stay tuned, drop your guesses down below for what the announcement will be. After that, I did an unboxing with a few bits that I got in from Christian Dior. I'm working with them to promote their gift sets and I just recorded like a quick little insta story in this beautiful rat and boa like floral see-through dress that I absolutely love. Y'all that gift set is a one. Okay I tried on the Oud perfume. It smells incredible. I'm gonna love going through those seven perfumes. It's a really good size as well. I need to find a cute place for the candle. So we shot that and then we went out and we shot this super cute two-piece suit set from Derek Lamb. You guys know I love Derek Lamb. I've worked with them for about five years off and on. They're really amazing. I've gone to some of their showroom visits, but they sent me over a few of their pieces for spring. And this two-piece short suit with the blazer that the sleeves unzip, you gotta get it. I am wearing a six in the jacket which fit perfectly and a four in the bottoms i feel like their dresses and their bottoms run about one size big so i size down I'm, I'm normally a six i got the shorts in a four they fit perfectly um with the jacket i just went with my normal size a size six because i do have pretty broad shoulders but absolutely love that look i paired it with my alexander votier polka dot sandals that i totally forgot i had until i unpacked them um, and just some black sunglasses from and other stories. I will link all of that down below. I wore a little bralette from Chua the Label. Chua the Label has amazing bralette tops. I have a few of their tops. And then last but not least, I shot my last two dresses from Karen Millen. A super beautiful floral dress with kind of like a cow neck, fluttery sleeves, slits on both sides. Um, I paired that with my new green Oran Hermes sandals. I feel like the color green and the dress and the sandals just worked perfectly. I wore um, my Carolina Herrera drop ball earrings. They're super old, not available. And just again, my And Other Story sunglasses. And then the final look, I still have it on, is this stunning, like asymmetrical lime green cow neck dress. It is lined. It's such a beautiful color. It's really given feminine, flirty, and fun. Um, there's a little band across the waist, so it kind of hides anything you don't want shown. I'm wearing the size six. Fits perfectly. I love it. I will link it down below, and I just paired that with um, my Bottega oversized Jody bag and my Bottega mules. Really push through. I'm glad I changed my lip to the NARS Mysterious Red just in case you're wondering and I put that on top of that absolute New York that I was wearing. I'm very happy with all the content I shot for brands and also just organic content for myself. I am a strong believer in batch shooting ever since I had a full-time 9 to 5 job as a doctor of physical therapy. I worked anywhere from 40 to 50 hours a week. Every weekend I would batch shoot anywhere from four to eight outfits and post those throughout the next two weeks it made my life so much more simple it enabled me to actually enjoy my life while creating content and not just every part of my life becoming content i find that when i batch shoot i feel like okay i got the content like now i can go live <laughs> you know i'm definitely gonna wear the outfits you all see anything i shoot that's on my instagram i wear it at some point out and about but I feel like it's just a little bit too much pressure for me to like actually get 
dress up solely to go take a picture while like going to dinner i want to just get dressed and go enjoy my dinner that's really why i enjoy vlogging because it captures the real like moments yeah i'm gonna take a little content but i'm not gonna take an hour out of like my dinner time to try and get a picture if i can get one something quick great most of the time it ends up in a vlog or in stories batch shooting it just works for me and my lifestyle um, i'm trying to get into shooting more things like on the spot if i can but nothing that's going to take away from like me enjoying the moment so that's kind of how i separate church and state <laughs> state church being the job part of influencing state being me actually enjoying the moments and being present in the moments and enjoying my life um, even though I believe that people really do like to see more of those in the moment shots, like that moment is for me. <sighs> okay, that was a little rant. <laughs> I don't know why I did that, but I get so many questions about how people, how you can do this while having a, a full-time job. And I did this for 10 years while having a full-time job. So it's, it's possible. You just have to plan. Also, I do realize I'm very privileged because I don't have much responsibility. I don't have children. So I feel like that frees up a lot of time. So I'm going to take this dress off. I'm going to put something a little more comfortable on. By the way, shout out to Karen Millen for gifting these two dresses and for sponsoring a portion of today's video. Remember, I have linked everything from them down below. Um, I'm going to change into something more comfortable, probably throw on some sneakers or something. And then I'm going to head to eat. I have a taste for Yardbird. I haven't been to Yardbird in months. Okay, guys, it's time. Your girl needs some chicken, a biscuit, a drink. So I'm gonna head to Yardbird and take you guys with me. I also just got a package in from Loewe. You guys know I love Loewe. It's a little something that I bought uh, for my birthday extravaganza weekend. So we'll do a little unboxing and uh, we'll go and grab something to eat. And then I have an event to go to tonight at seven. We're gonna go to that event and we're gonna close out this vlog because it's gonna be very long. Shout out to my editor. She doing it, not the two. All right guys, so here is the look for lunch. I am wearing this green midi dress. It has a little ribbing in it. It's really lightweight, which is great because it's very hot today. Um, this dress is from Reformation and I'm wearing the medium. Fits great, nice and loose. Um, and I just paired it with my P448 sneakers. These are made with recycled materials super comfortable i've been wearing them everywhere love these um i will link the dress and the sneakers down below for the bag just my bottega oversized jody bag by the way i get asked a lot about my camera my tripod it's always linked all the way at the bottom of my description box so if you want to get a camera it's the canon mark 2 g7x i get my tripod from amazon and it's always linked in every single video, all the way at the bottom of the description box. All right, so let's go get something to eat. Alright y'all, so I am back home from Yardbird. It was so good. I don't know if they have a new chef or something, but the shrimp and grits, banging. So savory. The, the sauce, oh my god, the shrimp, the grits, all of it. Incredible. Um, I also had a blackberry mimosa. That was good too. Um, and the water. I don't know what they put in their water, but the water is delectable. Okay, and I'm a bit of a water connoisseur, so I can vouch for the water at Yarbird that it's crisp and delicious. Tastes like it was just collected off of a glacier somewhere in Antarctica. Okay, forgot to show you guys what I got from Loewe. I've been seeing my girl Simi Moonlight over on Instagram. I love her. She is incredible and amazing. 
just got her like first i believe like model gig with fashion figure so shout out to her definitely check her out she's actually been featured in a few vlogs but she has this and every time she wears it i'm like i need it like it's so many things that like i compare with it but like look at this stunning packaging it came in like a day i love that it has a little card here i believe in here is just yeah my receipt which is nice, it has the little loewe all over it, which is cool. And I'm loving this like little lemon. How cool is that? So let's open this together. You could probably figure out what it is just based on the box. But I believe I'm gonna wear this during my birthday. So let's open it up. Can you guess what it is yet? Expertly wrapped. Is this stunning scarf. Actually, I believe it's called something else, but she has worn this so many ways. She's worn it as a sarong, as a top, as like, uh, it is beautiful. Look at how rich and vibrant that magenta is and then kind of like that orangey gold. I am definitely gonna wear this during my birthday. I have a swimsuit that matches this like yellow. It's gonna be everything, you guys. Like can definitely wear this as a top Ugh, it's already giving and i haven't even like it's huge by the way if you're interested i'll link it down below loewe has some incredible scarves i can even put it on my head because y'all it's been so hot like i need to start wearing a hat because my part it be burning how cute is this oh it's a vibe Sorry, I'm a, I'm a little shiny from being out in the hot sun, but this is what I got. It is incredible. I'll link it down below. I ended up just ordering it from their website because I couldn't find it any other place. And I feel like it's um, from their last season, so it's probably gonna be out of stock soon. So if you love it, get it now. So that's what I got from Loewe. I just filmed a reel. I didn't show you guys that, but if any of you watch Moesha, you know the music at the end when she's like, Dear Diary, such and such and such. I wanted to make one of those, so I just filmed one. I'm gonna try and get it up in the next couple of hours. But I think it's so funny. I have three new packages in. I'm gonna relax until my event tonight with Greece. So I will check back in with you guys then, but I'm gonna figure out all the cool ways I'm going to style this stunning scarf because it is everything all right guys sorry it's a little dark but i just posted the reel that i created today to the moesha like dear diary music it's hilarious if you're not following me on instagram you have to go over there and check it out so i want to show you guys my outfit for the greece event tonight i heard there's going to be plenty of drinks and plenty of food so i just kind of brushed up my, make my makeup a bit I put on these Ana Luisa earrings and this is a new jacket that I got in from D Sequel. It's their collaboration with Stella Jean, who I love. She is a Haitian and Italian designer. Absolutely love the collab. It's probably still in stores. So if you have a DeSeagull near you, go visit. If you don't, it's definitely online and I'll link this and a few more pieces from the collection that I love. So here's a closer look at the bomber it is long sleeve i just have the sleeves rolled up it says fresh coffee of haiti i love how she's always representing her culture on the back i can't get the back for you all but the back is super cool i love the colors um i bought this from the collection and i bought a skirt they have so many good pieces. Like if you guys just head on over to the sequel's website because they have tons of pieces and I will link a few of my favorites down below. I got this in a medium. It is meant to fit oversized, but I think it's gonna rain tonight. So I just wanted an extra layer. I still have on the same um, Reformation dress from earlier. And then for the sneakers, I actually brought these sneakers before I had my P448 sneakers from Amazon y'all and they give you the same feel a nice clean classic white sneaker they are very very comfortable and true to size a nice white sneaker 
to go with any outfit. So I'll link the sneakers down below too. So that's tonight's look. Let me show you tonight's fragrance, which I already sprayed on. I'm gonna grab a bag, call an alto, and we're gonna go eat. So tonight's fragrance is a mixture of Jo Malone Wood Sage and Sea Salt, which is very fresh, very beachy. It smells like a really serene Miami vacation to me. And of course, Baccarat Rouge 540, which is just a beautiful, very sophisticated, smell and I love how they pair together. So for the bag I just want something simple so I'm going with this cream bag from Coach that I love. I actually bought this for my birthday last year. It has a little pocket in the back that I stuff my phone in. It's super cute. It does have a crossbody strap but I'm just going to carry it with the top handle. It comes in a ton of colors. Very affordable. I actually just recently did a blog post about Coach Outlet. If you've never heard of Coach Outlet you have to go over to fashionstealnyc.com and check out that post. All the bags at Coach Outlet are on sale for 70% off and I linked like I don't know, maybe like 50 of my favorites from the website. So definitely head there and check it out. So many good bags. So that is the look for this evening. And I've linked everything down below. country via gastronomy. We have uh, brought with us three amazing chefs. We were about, we were planning to bring four, but unfortunately the fourth one is a fashion victim, so got COVID last minute. 